Today, you are gonna learn how to copy paste inside of Vamp. If we had a bigger budget, this is where a giant epic startup intro thing would go. We don't have that. Just go into the terminal. Okay, so once again inside of terminal, we're gonna open up Vim with our file that we have pre-made here. Uh, it's called copy paste here. You might feel inclined to say, but Thomas, what about this file? I don't have it on my computer. To that, I would feel inclined to say, shut up, it's a really easy file. So if we go in, you'll see. No need for a fuss, right? So here we have one, two, three, four, just a bunch of numbers, you know. And what we're going to want to do is enter into visual mode in order to be able to highlight things, much in the way that you'd use your mouse and move around the screen in order to highlight stuff. But we're in terminal here, and well, using mouse is for noobs in terminal land, and so we're gonna have to use our keyboard. And the way we do that in Vim is to go into visual mode with V, you see there, and you see visual mode down at the bottom. So from there, we can move around with our mouse, uh, with our arrow key, excuse me, um, and uh, highlight whatever we want. Let's just highlight this one and a space afterwards. And in order to copy, we hit Y, because we yank it out, and then we can go and paste it in. Uh, so let's go over to this three, for instance. And if we hit P, then to paste it in, you'll see that the one appears directly afterward, along with that space that we had uh, highlighted when we yanked it. So P is to paste directly after the thing that you have highlighted there. Let's undo with you there. And so you'll see one more time, uh, there's a three, then space, then a four. So if we paste it in, we have one space and then space four from what was there before. You can also paste in directly before by pressing shift P or just a capital P. You can see there's our one with a space afterwards. Let's undo again. Another thing that you can do, uh, if you can undo, you might want to know how to redo, correct? So uh, let's uh, paste, or not paste, let's just type some stuff, some stuff in here. And say we undo it, but we want to put it back. We can put it back by hitting Control R there for redo. So just so you know. More cool stuff that you can do with visual mode. You know how you can just hit V there in order to uh, go directly there. Let's escape. Uh, you can hit Shift V or capital V, and you can automatically highlight everything that's there inside the line. And then if you hit yank, for instance, Y, and then paste it, you'll see it goes down to the next uh, line. And the reason for that is because when you have everything highlighted like this, you see at the very end of the, of the line, there's also a new line character there. And that also gets yanked in, and then when you paste it, well, it's, it also gets put in, so it goes down to the, the very next line. You'll notice that if we just go into regular visual mode and we just highlight everything not using V, we don't actually have that new line character selected. So if we yank and then we paste it in, you see it doesn't go to the next line. But whatever, that's just a little trivia. More things you can do, you can hit YY instead if you want to be a little bit quicker. Instead of going to visual mode and then yank and then paste, blah, blah, blah. You can stay completely in normal mode there just by hitting YY like that. And that yanks everything from, the, uh, from that line puts it down to the next. So now you know how to copy paste, you know how to undo, redo. Go have a party!